How's it going, YouTube Toxic Clam here? So, there's more unboxing to be done, as you saw yesterday. I hope you saw uh, my last video. We opened the pumpkin guy, but so um, we got more of Grocery Gang. Got this 10 pack here. There you go. Got this 10 pack, this 2 pack, and Cyber Slot Pizza. So, this may be a long video, but, so let's, um, it's gonna be okay if it's long. So, let's start off with Cyber Slop Pizza, okay? So, here we go. We're gonna just open him up from the top. I don't want to ruin the art on this, because that would be horrible. Can I just, you know, so like, Oh, okay. I totally forgot again. So it says, Cyber Slop Pizza is a slimy cyber slice with an, a mission and nothing's going to stop him. Half machine, half mozzarella, this sloppy pizza will, has come back from the future to collect as much as grossness that he can from the future. Filthy futuristic hands on what well, he can get his filthy future fu futuristic hands on um And he's not leaving until every drop of slop is sucked up so slide the slop pizza So it, This guy already looks awesome right off the bat He looks but he looks like putrid pizza, but evil version. Okay. Alright, there we go. We got him out. So. Alright, here's his gun. As you saw, the toma tom tomato. The. Um. The pumpkin guy had a gun too, so I think they all have guns. So here's his gun. It's another, you could just flick it and, or I didn't flick it that much. It did fly off the table. So, got the flick and launch um, weapon. So let's just pull out him. Wow, look at that, guys. It's metallic. The camera's not really picking up the metallicness. But, like, right here, right here. Again, it's all plastic. Not squishy and his arm is wow just amazing and his cape is kind of flimsy which is really cool so this oh my gosh and can you take off his head oh you, you can take off his head and his cape so like if you have a putrid pizza you could change the head for a normal putrid pizza head um of course, that'd look kind of weird because it'd be like that because of pu the way Putrid Pizza's head is. So, here we go. He, oh, whoops. Got to put his cape on. I'll put the, uh, his cape on in a second. Here, let's just put him back here. Oh, well, no. Let's just put his cape on. There we go. And then you grab his cape. Basically, just put it on there. And then put his head on. Ah, it's kind of hard to get on. Oh, that's because the cape's in this way. Alright, so all you do is just put his head on a little bit. Like, okay, his head does not want to go on. His cape does not want to go on, but that's fine. It's fine. He, he doesn't have to have his cape on right now. Ugh, his head doesn't even want to. There we go. A snap of success so there he is looking very very cool so little cape looks kind of creepy in that pose and of course we have <clears throat> we have his weapon just straighten his head so he doesn't look as creepy oh whoops nope his weapon did not want to stay in the heck 
Okay, so here's Cybersop Pizza. His, okay, he's falling apart. His cape doesn't want to go on. His little gun thing doesn't want to stay in. But otherwise, again, Moose Toys has done a very excellent job. I mean, that's just awesome. And then, of course, we get the mini character. The little cyber slot pizza. Now, this one is squishy and plastic. And then you could put it on your pencil. So, that's really awesome. Then you could put them on the gun, but I'm not going to do that. Um, if you want to see me do that, then check the other uh, video. But, because this gun does is like in a bad mood right now, so we're not going to do that. Okay, so next we have this two-pack. Okay, so again, the artwork, like I said in the last video, just outstanding. Just, just, wow, it's just amazing. Good job to Moose Toys. Okay, so again, I have a, or not again, I have a, a yeah, so Moose Toys did like an excellent job on this. Okay, so we're just gonna crack this open, even though it does not want to be opened. Here, I think we have some scissors back here. Hello, scissors. Scissors. Okay, found the scissors. So this will help us. Oh, wait, that was the plastic. Okay, so let's just cut a little right here. There we go. I feel so bad for cutting this amazing artwork, but... Alright. So, let's see what's inside here. Just... Ah. Okay. Oh, there goes the checklist. The checklist. If you want to see the checklist, uh, look at my last video with the pumpkin guy. Alright. So, here we are. Let's just take this thing off. Okay, then the funnel comes off. Again. Oh no! The funnel comes off. <laughs> Sorry about that. And then that comes off, and then we have our paper. So, of course, I think you could rip across it, but this is a way more fun way to do it. So, you, uh, you open your lid, you grab your funnel, this part, just put it inside the lid. It tells you on the checklist how to do it, but, okay, so, here we go. Okay, so it's starting to fizz, oh, see that? Gonna start to hear it fizzing soon. Trying to be quiet so you can hear it fizz. So, let's see who is in here, who is hiding in here. So, let's just pour all the water out. You. Look at all that water. Alright. So, inside here. Oh. Whoop. Never mind. Okay. We got Barf Shark. We got last time. Yesterday. And then, we got, oh, oh, I know who he is. So, we basically just got a duplicate pack, oh, got a duplicate pack of yesterday, whoops. If you want to see that video, um, just, ah, he keeps, he's so slippery. Um, if you want to see that video, it's, uh, just, Go and see that video, I guess. I have nowhere to lead on what I was saying there. Okay, and then all that fizz stuff. Got the fishbone weapon. And please check out the other video where I had the barf shark, the apple action figure, and all that. It's really amazing. Okay. So, if we can find the weapon, he's got his little snake. A little snake. 
And then he got this guy has his little fishy friend. There we go. Really looking really really cool. We're just gonna leave them in here because they're already wet and so why not? They're just gonna take a little dip in the pool. Okay. Let's just push this back a little. Just like in the back. Okay. Actually, no. We'll have them up front. So, there we go. We got all of these characters. So now we have our 10 pack. Our 10 pack. Here, let me just. There we go. So, here we go. I'm going to open this up. Alright. I'm going to try to open it up on here now. Try not to knock anybody over while I open it up. Okay, I'll just open it up. Um, off camera and you could just uh, look at the shark and boot. Okay. okay. Sorry guys, it's just really big and I don't want it to knock anything over. Okay, so here we are. It's open. So, here we go. Let's see who is in here. Okay, so there's a checklist that's there too, but it doesn't really matter. So, looks like first up. Here, let me just move everything to the side so actually you guys can see it. It's right here. So, we got this guy from here. So, this guy's name is the first, or the second group, third, yeah, second. So, his name is Puku Clock, and he is a rare, he's a rare Puku Clock. He has a little, little guardian here. So, I'm going to pop it open. Oh, oops. Wow, that went flying. Here's a little birdie friend. So cuckoo. Cuckoo clock. There we go. Just move him back here. And then next we have this little hook guy right here. So let's see what is it, what the accessory is. So Let's see what this guy's name is, but first, let's add his weapon. He looks like he has a snake kind of friend guy. Is it a snake, a worm, something? So let's check what he is. He has a little pirate hat. His name is Horrid Hook. So he's like a fishing hook. Like fish out like a little string fishing hook pretty cool so these grocery gang new grocery gang characters are just amazing just like the detail and all of that just moose toys you've really outdone yourself and then so this guy looks like he's a I have no idea who this guy is. Looks like looks like a little little uh, sun phone. Is he a telephone? Sorry, guys. I think he's a Oh no, he's over here. Slop watch. Slop watch. Stop watch. Slop watch. Pretty cool. Let's move him over there. Go. We also have to add him in the picture. There we go. Alright, slop watch. Pretty cool. And let's see what his accessory is. So. Looks like his accessory is a stick with poo on it. 
the poo stick. Well, I don't know what that is. Ice cream? Hang on. This looks like kind of poo ice cream. I think it might be ice cream because it has the cherry on the top. Oh, whoops. Sorry, guys. This thing fell out. Okay. So, we got Slockwatch assemble his poo ice cream. Ice cream cherry thing. If it will let me. There we go. Oh, yeah, and as you see on the bottom, that's like the bottom top. Wow, that's really cool. Really, really cool. Okay. So, next, we got one of my favorites out of this pack. Okay. So, this is one of my favorites. Don't know his name, but, but he looks really cool. So let's see if the camera will pick it up. Yeah, the metallicness on his head is just really, really, really cool. So let's see what his name is. Looks like he'd be from the middle medieval. <laughs> yep. Busted Battle Axe. This guy's name is Busted Battle Axe. He has a little little spiky stick thing. Figure thing. There we go. There we go. Busted battle axe. So let's just put them like right here. Alright. And then here's another really cool one. Ah, there we go. A little burry. And he caught in this birdie comes with the little thing. This guy definitely looks like he'd come from the um the uh pirates. Looks like he's holding a board. A wooden board. Let's see what that is. Uh, the pirates, right? Yeah. Oh, whoops. Dropped the checklist. So his name is Putrid Parrot. Putrid Parrot. Yeah. Looking pretty cool. And my other favorite, coming from the same era, is this spiky looking dude. Comes with the sword. This is one of my favorites. He's really bright orange. Don't know if the camera's picking that up, but he's really bright orange. It's just those lumps. That's just really cool. So let's see what this guy's name is. Alright, his name is Mucky Mace. It's like, you know, those, um, those balls with the spikes on them, and then they're, they're attached to a chain. That's what that guy is. And then, I'm guessing this guy is going to be the common. Oh, nope, there goes his weapon. And this guy right here. You want to get his weapon? So, I'm guessing this guy's going to, oh, and it's another, like, see his orange end. This guy, I'm guessing, is going to be a common, where, like, you get, like, a hundred of these, like, you know, in, um, series three, with the blobfish and all that. I'm guessing this guy's one of them, a really, really common one. So there we go. And then, of course, we have, just making sure that doesn't, the weapon doesn't go flying. Um, got this rice bowl, I'm guessing. Looks like he's from the samurai, because look at his head right there. And he looks like rice. See, rice soldier. He's probably lice. 
rice, 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 something like that. So his name is Lice Rice. So I was right. He's Lice Rice. Lice. Okay. So that's all for the visible characters. Now we have this toilet. So I just open this with the scissors. Scissors are man best friend, man's best friend. After dogs, scissors are man's best friend. Wait, oh what? Be careful whenever you're cutting things, kids. So you don't cut your finger. Don't cut any part of you because that would be bad. Okay, there we go. Got a little hole in there. There we go. So, so there we go. Got this. But there's still more wrapping. Huh. This I thought we took off the wrapping, but I guess there's like two layers of wrapping. So let's just open this. Sorry guys. So we got this like thing telling you how to do it. But we already knew how to do it. So you open this. Let's bring our good friend. The bucket here. Put that right there. Sometime I might. Oh, we're, we are out of water. Okay, let's just borrow some from here, maybe. Could we do that, please? <sighs> Need to get more water next time we do this. Okay, so this may take a while. Okay, I think one more would do it, and go, well that's good, we're just going to do one more, so there's no, none, so you could just also open it this way, it's not as fun though, alright, wow, who is this guy that I'm seeing, right here, let's take out this, we got a pineapple I see in there, so we got a squishy and hard character. Whoa! That water went flying at me. Okay, so let's just pour out the water. There we go. Hello. Hello, can you please come out to play? Alright, so we got a pineapple. A mad looking pineapple. So here we go. I'm just going to put him back here for now. Sorry guys, you can't see him. Now. This guy. Wow. Wow. This is amazing. Hands down amazing. Wait, oh! He fell. This guy's squishy. He is squishy. But he's just, look at that. Oh, he's dripping. That's just amazing. So we're just gonna put this our good friend back here. And then get the pineapple right here. So that is just awesome, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, it really, it really makes me happy when I see views on my videos. So just thank you so much for all of the support and the um videos and please guys don't forget to like and subscribe to my videos for more grocery gang tell me what you guys want to do what you want me to do and just um just thank you so much for all of that like those views just like 300 views wow just 
that's amazing so thank you so much again um i will see you guys in my next video and so just bye see you guys in my next video